so now it's real simple, right? Just TR over J. Uh, so this tau would be 37.5 pound feet. R uh, is not always the outer radius, but R is how far away from the center of the cross section are you. Um, but if it asks for the maximum, then yeah, that's, that's telling you, hey, what's the stress at the outer edge of the radius? So as far away as we can get from the radius. So that R, uh, if the rod has a, be careful, diameter of 0.5 inches, the radius 0.25 inches. Let me look at my units here because I've got, looks like I've got feet and inches. Might have to um, reconcile those. And the J, J, we have a formula for J on your formula sheet. I think I passed that out a, a while back. Um, it's pi by two, C to the fourth, and that C is the R. Pi by two, R to the fourth. Now let's think about these units. Uh, pounds, inches, inches to the fourth. Uh, I'm gonna change that feet to inches. How can I do that? Feet, inches, 12 inches, one foot. All right, so now I've got two inches on top, I've got four inches on bottom, and so that cancels out to just two inches. Pounds over inch squared, PSI. So be, be careful right there. And so this would be 18,300 PSI, 18.3 KSI. All right. So if you want to know the shear stress or the torsional stress, right, the stress caused by torsion, first you got to find that T, that torque T, and then TR over J. All right. TR over J. Let's look at the next 